what am I doing first thing in the morning? Well, replacing my wing mirror because it's... Look at this. Look at this video. Yeah, that's right. Someone crashed into my wing mirror. So... Yeah, man, I'm here to replace it. Pretty straightforward, really, so I thought I might do it at work. And then I'm going to get John to replace the other side later on. <sighs> Grief. This van never stops. Like, you know, it's costing me a lot of money. But anyway, I'm going to be giving this to my brother sooner than later. <laughs> You see that? You see that? Because otherwise you have to like finger it. Hey, is that even allowed on YouTube? <laughs> there you go. Do you know what I mean? Look. See? I didn't have to fiddle with it. Just had to give it a little pull. And that is it. Oh yeah, my van is cool again. Look at that. Fresh, not broken. Same with this. Oh yeah. No more sharp edges. You love to see it. Right, so good morning. We are on the first job now uh, on this Seiya Ibiza and as you can see there on the charging test Nothing mate, it's not oh, so everything has failed. You can see we tested it 11.99 John start the car You can see there it's not charging anymore and that is with the engine turned on as well we've checked the fuses as well the fuses are good so there's no chance that is the fuse so we will be checking the wiring as well just in case it is the wiring so let's get to it man let's go uh this is annoying yeah it's the one that you have to remove the tensioner we can stop working on it long thing milwaukee power milwaukee power love it was milwaukee are they gonna sponsor me yet anytime soon please I'm gonna need 30 mil. That season is upon us mechanics again. The time that we have to replace alternator, battery and starters. Unfortunately, they like to fail in the winter as they have to work harder. Long to explain it all, but they are common to fail in the winter. The thing is, when we got here, it was actually charging. working fine. Yeah, it was charging. And then once we turned off the car, it stopped. So realistically, if you think about it, it does rule out fuses and the wiring and stuff like that. Everything looks well anyway, so I checked the wiring as well, all is good. But yeah, as you can see here, look, there's like straws in the hay straw thing. But yeah, anyway, Lucas, of course. So that's what we're going to be fitting. Let's get to it. Hey, John, you get involved? No, mate. You're sending it? You get involved, send, yeah? Full send. Full send. Oh, okay. I'm going to drop this somewhere. There you go. Do you know what I hate the most, John? You know when I don't have the diagram for the belt and then I have to guess where it goes and stuff. It's still long. It's a work of art, dude. Yeah, it's a work of art, man, indeed. Right, so we have just finished installing it now. And as you can see right there, fresh. Not brand new second hand, brand new. Right, so that is us done on this now. All is good. It's charging. I've just thrown the result away as well. God, I have to look through this now. Is it this? Ah, yeah, this is the one. Starter, as you can see there, 10.41 for when it starts. Load off, 14 volts, load on 12.96. Obviously, the battery is a bit weaker, but when uh, we tested it again, it was fine. It was creeping at 13.6, so yeah, all is good, man. We'll give this back to the customer and we'll get to it. And there we have it. A complete and successful repair for this customer. As you notice, the fast fit company where we filmed this video apparently cannot do this job, which I found a bit odd, but anyway, Let's go to the next. Is it wrong for me to profile people because the guy just looked dodgy, didn't he? Proper. Yeah, it looks like this guy. Ah. Uh. I'm not paying. Oh, see you later. Oh. He left the pry bar. He left the pry bar. Nah, not me, mate. You were the one packing. On to the next. Right, so we are on the way. On the second job. Well, third, realistically. Third, third. And look at this. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. You love to see it, hate to be in it. It's one of them ones, but we'll enjoy it, right? Because we're mobile, we love to do it. Don't we, John? No. No? What, is it just, is it just me? Is it just me? Yeah. I don't mind the rain, you know? Do you? I don't like it in Oh, because you're a little cat, aren't you? You're a little kitten, aren't you? Mm. Have you got your little, um, little violin, mate? Yeah. No, no, I think I put it in my pocket. Here it is. Look, 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 look. Ah! 
and we are now on the second third job we're here to obviously diagnose this it's a non-star heating doesn't work car died etc so uh, look, look, look. hey john do you know what's wrong with it yeah what's wrong with it show me then show me tell me no i'll show the camera though go on go on go on guys ready what's that look at this one. look 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 Seize. mate that is it's shitty oh oh sorry Andy. <laughs> the jump pack on so we're gonna try and uh, crank it anyway to see if it starts 12.2 volts that shouldn't stop man there we go uh, it starts so that's fine but obviously it's not charging because the alternator is sh sh so we're gonna go and get the alternator for this we've got everything in stock apparently that's good just trying to remove this so i can show people how crappy duty it is pretty straightforward this question for you john will it fit uh, coming out here will it fit right. how much space this is actually spinning now oh yeah it wasn't wasn't it but listen to it oh. yeah i can't believe it man to be honest is very well off yet she wants to go for a very cheap job and like what I always say to you John the stingiest people are probably the richest stay up in it that's what it is bro that's what it is man that's what it is I want to be stingy well I am already but I'm you know I'm trying to be rich like her all right <laughs> I'm poor as hell I think you want no 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 it's not the brand new second hand order. It's brand new, brand new. No, brand new, brand new, brand new, 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 new. It's the new one. Oh man! Please don't drop. Please don't drop. Please don't drop. There you go. All right, so we have done that. Now that's the second alternator for the day, and then we're gonna go to a Renault, either a Master or one of them. Not Master. Traffic. Yeah, that's the one. Renault traffic. But anyway, look at this. All done. This vehicle was previously diagnosed by a fast fit retail chain to have a battery issue. However, it seems like they have missed out something very important when it comes to the battery system. And that's the alternator. I'm glad that our customer called us to have it properly rectified. So that's, that's all good. Now we're just waiting for the woman to come back. She's had her battery replaced, thinking that it was her battery. Whoever replaced it, probably Halfords from the looks of things, because this is Yuasa. Halfords sells Yuasa and obviously their own brand as well. And they did not check that the alternator was shot. And there was no belt. So yeah, man, anyway, let's move on. Let's go to North London to do the Renault. I just said it, man. Renault Traffic! Yeah, that's the one. So, see you guys in a minute. Look at this setup, boys and girls. And dark. What in dark? What in dark, mate? Just the way you like. Flash and lines over there, mate. So, what are we doing on this? Alright, so we are replacing the shock absorber. Also, doing a gearbox service and brake service on this as well. I'm not talking about changing the disc and pads. Talking about replacing the fluids. Yeah. It's gonna be a late one, probably finish here about six o'clock, so we don't have the time to waste. Look at that leak. Telling me it's not doesn't need changing. Look at that. That came out nicely, but let's see if we can compress this down without dying. Because look, it's so long. We're gonna die. We're gonna die. <laughs> and we are. Oh there you go. There you go, there she is. Alright, just uh, get the seal. Well, You're gonna leave me here with this? Yeah. Hey. Scared, dude. So, um, it's cold outside, guys. Night hunters galore. Let me uh, introduce myself. Uh, my name is John. You guys can call me JJ. I'm new here. Hope you guys enjoy my stay. It's Monroe! Not Who? Madeline, but Monroe! <laughs> Kelsey. Yeah, it's Monroe, mate. Look at this. Look at that leak. Oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh my hair. Yeah, that's shinished. Oh. Why are you jacking the roll? Oh, sorry, bro. Get on with it. Sorry. You've been here before, and I know that you know how scary it can get when replacing these springs, particularly long springs like this one. Let's keep our focus and get this replaced. 
safely oh, that is. We in? We in? We in, we in. Oh, oh. <laughs> yes, that was scary. What we're doing here now is trying to secure the spring by threading in the nut that holds the shock absorber onto the top. That way, we can be somewhat finally be safe. Uh, now re release it completely. Is it on, yeah? This needs to plug down. Yeah, let me know when. Yeah. That's mad scary, man. Oh, yeah, fresh. Fresh, fresh. Well, that was an idiot moment, isn't it, John? Just a little bit. It's not a little bit, I think it's a major one. A lot of it. So, we were just trying to fill up the gearbox. He was. Uh, I was anyway, right? And <laughs> the tube actually fits in a screw hole, in a bolt hole. Now, I was trying to put it there. I was like, why the? Is it not going in? Why is it leaking? And then, I looked on the other side, I was putting it in the wrong hole. <laughs> Criminal. <laughs> but anyway. Amateur anyway. behaviour. It is amateur behaviour, mate. It's a John behaviour. My yeah, God. Yeah, I'm a pro, man. Oh, sorry, man. Yeah, to be fair, you found the plug hole. I was looking for it. I couldn't find it. God. Alright. Cool. Just get to it. How much more? It's finished. It's... Oh. Oh, 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 I said it. I said it's finished. <laughs> Oh hey, so that is that sorted now. So the transmission service on that one, and we've also replaced the shock absorber with a Monroe shock absorber. As you can see right there, that's new. New gearbox oil as well. You know because I stink, I stink of fish. Yeah, so the brake fluid has been renewed as well. So that's probably going to be good for another two years but i personally would recommend changing it every year if you can two years is good as well i'm gonna go for a test run just to double check that there's no clunking noise coming from the uh, top mount or the shock absorber let's say so i'll catch you guys in a minute hey john shall we do another job bro i'm done yeah i'm good huh but anyway that's where we're going to end it so thank you very much for watching please like share comment and subscribe and we will see you on the next one. Peace.